Good morning, National Dayers! It's Mrs. Erickson. Today is Friday, December 15th. It is the 349th day of the year. There are 16 days left. Happy National Wear Your Pearls Day. National Wear Your Pearls Day on December 15th reminds us that when life throws dirt our way, we all have value in the end. The beautiful result of nature's design, one irritating grain of sand can cause an iridescent pearl to form. Just as pearls come in a variety of shapes, sizes, and colors, so do people and the kinds of trials thrown into our lives. We create our own beauty from the tragedies of our lives, but often do not see it. Like pearls, we develop a process to protect ourselves from further damage layer by layer, becoming stronger and more resourceful. Recognizing the collective value of our strengths is like wearing our pearls. When life throws dirt your way, put on your pearls as a reminder that you have value regardless of your current circumstances. Marine oysters and freshwater mussels form pearls when an irritant such as sand, a parasite, or other damage is caused. Pearls come in many colors including white, pink, brown, and black. The type of shellfish and where they live determine the color. Put your pearls on today and remind yourself, I wear pearls as a reminder that I have purpose and value. Today is also Bill of Rights Day, International Tea Day, National Cupcake Day, and Cat Herders Day. All right, National Dayers, today we're actually going to make a pearl garland for our tree. This is fun. Gather the following supplies. So you'll need a bunch of little white beads, some string, and then I actually ended up using a needle to make it easier to put the string through the beads, but that part's not necessary. So the first thing you're gonna do is you're gonna thread one bead onto the end of your string and you wanna make your string kinda long, probably a good three or four feet. And then you're gonna tie that bead to the string so the rest of your beads don't fall off the end of your string. And then you're gonna spend a very long time threading all of those beads onto your string. But don't worry, it takes a while, but the ending is so great because look at this. Magic, right? We have a huge string of pearls that we now get to decorate our tree with. This is great. I cannot wait for us to see what this holiday tree is gonna look like. All right, National Dares. Somebody stole my pearls. That's not gonna work. We need these for the tree, mister. I'll trade you, look. I'll take the pearls. Oh my goodness, good job. And I'll give you a treat. That's a fair trade, right? All right, can I put you down so we can decorate our tree? Thanks, here, here's one more treat, buddy. Thank you. All right, we've got our pearls. We're going to decorate our tree. I don't wanna cover up any of our cool ornaments. We probably should have done this first, but that's just not the way the National Day is laid out, was it, my friends? All right. I'm going to put our pearls on our tree. Boy, this tree is just looking better by the day, my friends. I am so proud of us. All right, National Dayers, keep smiling. Have a fabulous Friday and go get fancy. Wear some pearls. See you next week. Bye. It's time for super spectacular shout outs. Shout outs today start us off with Miss Aparito, Miss Lorena, and Miss Myrna, and everyone in the grades 9 through 12 special education program at San Isidro High School in, in San Diego, California. Next up is Mrs. Oliver and everyone in the MOID program at Burkmar High School in Lilburn, Georgia. And our third shout out today goes out to Mrs. Shutok, Ms. Burke, and Mr. Elmer, and everyone in the grades 9 through 12 program at Middletown High School in Middletown, Delaware. Thank you so much for watching, and thank you for your support. I hope you loved your shout out. Teachers, if you'd like to get your class a shout out, just complete the Google form. The link can be found below this video in the description. 
And here it is, our updated Super Spectacular shout-out map. 